Heritage Lottery Fund use lottery funding to support heritage projects of all sizes. Heritage means more than people often think. It's not all about old buildings. In fact, heritage can include anything from the past that matters to people now, including the stories or traditions of particular communities. Working on a heritage lottery project means that support starts from the moment you have an idea. So here are some of the stories of just some of the 34 Salford projects who have recently benefited from heritage lottery funding. Yeah, this project is about um, recording life stories of refugees, uh, Jewish refugees and um, Holocaust survivors who came to Manchester trying to um, record their life and see how they helped to develop Manchester and the UK to the place it is as refugees and the way England um, has taken them on. The actual project we did was to make a, a play called Keep Calm, Carry On. Obviously we needed funding for sessional staff and for drama teachers, uh, for, for the theatre itself, for the costumes, etc. The project was um, about the margin steelworks in Earl and Carizad, which are, were massive industries for for the area um, and unfortunately they have both been closed down now but they employed thousands of people in this area so it was a really important um, piece of research for us to, to explore with the young people. The idea of the project really came from the fact that there is in this place here just a phenomenal amount of um, stories about different things whether it's boxing, football, uh, but one of the biggest stories is about camping. It was a mess, it was a mess. Well, as you can see, all the paths and everything have all improved. Well, they were just all rubble. Now they're all tarmac, even pegs. You can drive your mobility scooters all the way around. I mean, it's the walkway. I mean, the walkways now they've done. It goes all the way there. Well, a lot of people have got a good story to tell, and I think it, you know that's the point of it. Really, we're trying to put, collect these stories together, document them, and we're sharing them with other groups. So many youngsters lose their way and direction, and are not sure where they belong in the world and I think by reflecting on the past we can help people uh, build a stronger future and I, I see that as a big importance. All these stories get passed down and they get changed and it's really good to go back to all the original sources and then build, it all, build all the stories up around that. People should go into it anyway just to get the area improved. I mean it cleans the area up, it makes it tidy, it's better for everybody around. If you've got an idea approach the Heritage Lottery Fund first with that, um, with your ideas and go down and talk to him, get some support and guidance. If you're looking to do a project regards regards uh, anything regards heritage, um, you know, don't hesitate to, to, to what to do it, you know, get in contact with Heritage Lottery and they've got the staff down there and skills on there to come down and help you develop your project. I think, you know, every story, every person is a whole world of to themselves and every story, um, you know, every, for every story there's somebody which will listen to it and it will change their life, um, help them be a better person. Um, so for me, that's, I, th I think everybody should do that. If you have an idea for a heritage project in your area, then you can use our project inquiry service. We'll tell you if your idea has potential and guide you through the whole application process. There's also a special scheme for grants under £10,000 for community projects. It's called Sharing Heritage. So check out the website and why not try turning your idea into a reality with our support today. Mm -hmm.